Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Skyrim. Last time we were just doing some bits and bobs quests. Uh, today we're basically doing the same thing. Uh, just gonna pick some random quests. Um, I guess we're gonna do that one. So, yeah. I have no idea exactly where this quest marker is at. Well, that's just a random spot. Okay, so I have to head inside. And it's somewhere over here. I work with my mother. Sell fruits and vegetables. Yeah, yeah, kid. It's fun mostly. Ah, here we are. It is for the lady that was working in the Hall of the Dead over in Rift. I spend so much oh. time among the dead, I sometimes forget how much I miss the company of the living. Tell me, do you believe in mighty R.K., god of life and death? Uh... I mean... I see. Well, perhaps you'll take pity on a humble priest who has lost something precious. My amulet of R.K. It's the source of my divine powers and also a sacred badge of office. I misplaced it in the catacombs. I'd look for it, but I have been hearing noises down there. I fear the dead have become restless. So you want me to that do amulet, it? I'm powerless to confront them. Would you be willing to search for it? Sure, I'm heading down there anyway. I'll just wait here and make sure nothing foul escapes the catacombs. She finally decided to return it to her father. Bless her heart. I will make sure this finds its way to his tomb as soon as possible. Thank you for bringing it, my child. Blessing of our cool. baby upon you. Oh, now I have to go all the way back to her. Let's just do this really quick. Um, there we go. Oh, hello. Jeez. I mean, I'll take that. Dude. I think I'll just use this for a bit. Okay. Hmm, no skelly bums in here. Okay, cool. I guess let's check down here now. Search the tape. Ooh, gold. Huh. Only two skeletons, seriously? D okay. That was like very anticlimactic. Was very boring. 
Here, dude. And I spend so much time with this. Oh, thank Arkay. Please take this gold for your troubles. Thanks. Wow, only fifteen. Okay, cool. The blessing of Arkay be upon you. You have like a shrine to this dude. Yeah, there we go. I have no idea even what the blessings do. You and me. Okay. Let's just do that since uh we might as well. Uh yes. Just quick complete this mission. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. You there. What? The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? Oh, great. We're vampire hunters. We search out and destroy those blood sucking scum wherever we find them. Uh. You're not paying attention then. Like almost everyone else around here. I, mean, I did Haven't find you heard some. Of all the vigilance was destroyed by vampires. They never took the threat seriously, and now they paid the price. The vigilance mostly hunt down Daedra worshippers, which is why they got torn to pieces when they went up against vampires. That's why our leader, Izran, is re establishing the Dawn Guard. Real serious vampire hunters. Okay. Ha! Izran's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawn Guard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Dawn Guard material. Okay, whatever. I'll do that at some point. I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long. <laughs> Lady Mara bids you welcome to her benevolence. Yeah, okay, I'm not looking for you. Wait, where is she? Oh, that's right, she's like downstairs. Or. Where is it downstairs again? Ah, over here. Oh, wait, no, she's over here. pilgrimage is com I felt a caress on my cheek some time ago. I thought it to be a trick of the wind, but I think it was a message from my father. We've made peace with one another without even uttering a single word. And I'm content for the first time in my life. Cool. I thank you. Here, please accept this as a token of my appreciation for your selfless action. What do you give me? Uh. Please uh. come back and speak to me anytime. What did you give me? It. Uh. Whatever. I want to see what's in here. Or is there something to fight? What's this? Oh, I already have a. Okay. Is there really nothing in here? Oh, there's a body. Huh. Oh. I don't know. Okay. Um uh, I guess Yo, where the heck is the ragged flagon? Being barb. I know it shows like go down into the sewer. It. Just a dead dude here. Um, scorched hammer. Where is this ragged flagon place? Shit. 
star. No. Nope. Is it really down there? Oh, that's an elixirs. Beggar's row. Oh, that's a house. That's the rat way. Another house. Really, you're gonna attack me? Hey, I don't... I don't wanna fight you guys. do more than that. 16 base damage. Ooh, that only does 12. I will take the Orcish Bow. And I will throw my Ancient Nord Bow into you. Um, uh, oh, you also have arrows. I'll take those. Favorite. What was that? What'd you do? How is there something here to open this? a mace. Uh, lantern. I guess it just dropped down. That's a tripwire. What the heck is the ragged flagon? of the pugilist. Okay. Gold! Oh, bear traps. Or I should, I guess, it's keeper traps. Damage does my hammer do? 
26. Yeah, I'm keeping that. What's this? Beggar. Okay, cool. I'll I'll take that. Take the bread. Jeez. Hmm, wait. Take those apples. Because healing items. Ooh, further. Oh wait, this just brings me back. So I can take a drum. That what the heck is down here? Expert lock. Jeez. Oh. Ooh. So if we just do there. Oh, well over. Oh, that was close. Just do it about there. Oh. <laughs> Why does this seem very... What? It... This is just the same spot where I killed those guys. Sure, I'll take cheese, I guess. And the bread. Sure, I'll take the garlic, too. Wooden things. Bed. I mean, increase my lock picking, so I'm fine with that. Place is a little weird here. Anywho, let's go down here. The ragged flagon. Hello. Give it up, Brinio. Those days are over. I'm telling you, this one is different. We've all heard that one before, Bryn. Quit kidding yourself. It's time to face the truth, old friend. You, Vex, Mercer, you're all part of a dying breed. Things are changing. Dying breed, eh? Well, what do you call that then? Well, well, trouble, calling me impressed, trouble. lass. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. Uh, I'm not talking to you. I'm not here to hold your hand. Figure this one out for yourself. Here, uh, talk to you. I suppose I can work with your face. After all, the sculptor cannot always choose the finest clay. That was it. Yes. I once practiced my art in the salons and manners of Tamriel's great and good. Now the scum of Skyrim are my only clients. But no matter, the greatest artists are never recognized in their own time. So, are you here as a client? Shall I remake your face? Mm. I have not always been a ragged beggar. I learned my art from the masters of the art of flesh sculpture. I studied with the faculty of chirurgeons and cloud rest. I walked with the hollow-faced men of Notohogra for three years. I count the nobility of both the Empire and the Dominion among my clients. And yet, I have fallen so low that I must justify myself to a wanderer in the sewers of this backwater of the world. Jeez, okay. Change it. I can remake your face, if that's what you desire. I do not practice my art for free, however. I doubt you can afford my services. You have the smell of the vagabond about you. Right. Indeed. It is no small thing to submit yourself to the flesh sculptor's knife. 
Literally, there's just a way to change your appearance in game. That's literally it. Stay out of trouble, or there's gonna be trouble. Where'd that guy go? There he is. Well, well. Color me impressed, lass. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. Uh. If you were expecting yeah. a palace, then maybe you're not cut out for this line of work. Our methods involve secrecy and discretion. Now, why is, why if is you're that done belly aching like a child, how about handling a few deadbeats for me? They owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. Sounds Kirana, good. Percy Honeyhand, and Helga. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. Honestly, the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't to be ignored. You see, a word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. It's bad for business. Well, I get a cut? Of course you'll get a cut. We take care of our own. Now, if you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Get going. Kirava's stubborn, but she's got a soft spot for family. Talk to Tal and Jay at the B and Barb, and see if you can get something out of him. They're well acquainted, if you catch my meaning. Okay. Helga is a devout follower of Debella, and dotes over the statue to the divine that she keeps at the bunkhouse. Use it as leverage, and she'll cave. He's as pig-headed a man as you'll ever find. The key is that ugly dwarven urn in his shop. Smash that thing to bits and he'll change his attitude. Okay. I'll be here when you're done. Stay out of trouble where there's gonna be trouble. The rat wave vaults. By Ismir, you won't leave here alive. Okay. See ya. Uh how do I get back to the surface quicker? Instead of having to go through this entire, like, maze of sewer. Is there, like, a door I can just go through? No. This is annoying. I literally have to go through here no matter what. Oh wait, that's right, this is like a shortcut. Uh, I guess we'll be doing these quests. Oh wait, did I activate these quests? Uh... Ah. Jewelry with legendary Argonian craps Let's go through here. Let's do this one first. What do you want? I met her when I wandered into Riften a few years ago. Been smitten with her ever since. In fact, I'm thinking of asking her to marry me. In Black Marsh, tradition dictates we present a potential mate a unique wedding ring to represent our future bond. I already have the gold band, but all I need are three flawless amethysts to complete the setting. Mm, I don't... It, I was see. hoping you'd offer. I didn't think it was my place to ask such a favor of you. Mm. I thank you. With the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. The last thing I want is a war with your people. Mm. Look, I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't mistake this as acceptance for what you do. Kirava has some family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. If you mention you know about it, 
She might just listen to you. Just please don't harm anyone. I couldn't bear the thought. Mm. Every Argonian wedding proposal band is supposed to have three flawless amethysts as part of their design. Two of the gems, the ones on the outside, represent the couple to be married. One for the husband, one for the wife. The amethyst in the center represents the hist, the entity that all Argonians consider a sacred part of our lives. Okay. Okay. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to attend so to. Far. I don't have any business with you, so get ah, out of there she place. is. Here for a room or something to drink? Show me some coin first. No, and I never will. Now get out of my inn. How could you possibly know about... Please, my family means too much to me. Don't hurt them. Very well. Here, take this back to Brynjolf and tell him he'll have no more trouble from me. There we go. My skill in battle is unmatched. Okay. Uh, next one. Are you on the deck collector? Oh, jeez. So, can I interest you in anything today? What? Oh, it's one of you people. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother to show up himself anymore, eh? What's this message? Petty threats and fist waving are not going to sway me. You people are all talk, and everyone knows it. You demand payment for protection, and you can't even protect yourselves. Don't fool yourself. It's mm. only a matter of time before you people are run out of Riften. Likewise. Now I have a lot to do, so I'm afraid you'll just have to leave. Okay, where's that urn? I can't believe you're doing this. Stop! Oh my word. I'm sorry, you're going to have to leave. Tell Brynjolf he'll just have to make do without me. I can't believe you're doing this. Stop! Oh my word. No! That urn was priceless. All right, I get it. I'll pay on time from now on. Just don't smash anything else. Here, take your gold and leave me in peace. Yeah, that's what I thought. Last one. Destruction magic's fine. Just don't go burning down any buildings. Hey, yo, you owe some money. It's you. Please, don't hurt me. I know who you are. You've been terrorizing the entire city. Please, there's no need for that here. Message understood. Here, I even have the payment. Good. Pay on time next time. Cool. Oh, that was that was easy. Whee! Protect yourself right. Buy armor from Relka. Jewelry with legendary Argonian craftsmanship. Time to head back and report it. And... <laughs> Go through here. Walk across here. And down here. Ooh, I'm almost level 10. Stay out of trouble, or there's gonna be trouble. So. Job's done, and you even brought the gold. Best of all, you did it clean. I like that. Dumping bodies and keeping the guards quiet can be expensive. <laughs> well done. And it would seem I owe you something in return. Yeah. Here you go. 
I think you'll find these quite useful. Gold poison. No. Okay. Judging from how well you've handled those shopkeepers, I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. That's the spirit. Larceny's in your blood. The telltale sign of a practice thief. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. What's on your mind? Uh... We've run into a rough patch lately, but it's nothing to be concerned about. Tell you what, you keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Fair enough? Yeah, seems fair. Now, if there are no more questions, how about following me and I'll show you what we're all about. Cool, I got a trophy for that. I think you better listen to Mercer and Brignol first. We could talk later. Let me show you the operation. Uh, oh. Then you can ask your questions. Interesting. Yep. Let me go in. I'm gonna just move around for a minute. What do you got in here? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Nah. Ooh, I will take that gold. Since it wasn't letting me open that door. There we go. Still isn't letting me open it. Taking your cabbage and your cheese. Okay. Maybe if I save and then load. Nothing worth that in there. Let's wait until Brynjolf's here before we begin. Mercer, this is the one I was talking about. Oh. Our new recruit. This better not be another waste of the guild's resources, Brynjolf. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. Okay. You break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. What we say, when we say. Oops. Do I make myself clear? Yeah, I understand. Good, then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Wait a moment. You're not talking about Golden Glow, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work. So let her prove it. Golden Glow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Brynjolf will provide you with the details. Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Hmm? Oh, yes. Since Brynjolf assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us, then you're in. 
Welcome to the Thieves Guild. Cool. Welcome to the family, lass. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin, so don't disappoint me. Okay. Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, and talk to okay. Tanelia in the flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. Yeah. Wow. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. They raise the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouth wood elf named Arangoth. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hives and clearing out the safe in the main house. The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Okay, huh? Hi. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. What should we do? Maven prefers that Arangoth remains alive. But if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, kill him. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. Okay. Golden Glow Estate brought in a mountain of gold for the guild. You could almost call it our sweetest deal. Then out of the clear blue, Arangoth stopped sending us our cut. Mercer was, well, angry to put it kindly. So we send in Vex and find out he's hired a bunch of mercenaries to guard the place. Aye. Hmm. Arangoth sent the city guard packing and fortified the entire island. In fact, Vex barely made it out of there alive. You should talk to her about it before you go. Okay. They're built like small fortresses to resist the weather, but their one weakness is flame. Besides, oh. nothing tells the people of Riften we mean business better than a huge column of smoke. Okay. I'll give you one good reason. Maven Blackbriar. Burn all the hives, and she'd have to import honey for Blackbriar meadery, which would cut into her profits. Okay. We had an arrangement with Maven. We kept an eye on Golden Glow Estate to make sure the honey kept flowing. If the workers had a dispute, we'd rough them up. If competitors tried to buy honey from Arangoth, we'd steal the shipments. In return, Maven allowed us to extort Arangoth and bring in a huge payout. Okay. Let me put it to you this way. Nothing happens in Riften without Maven's consent. One word from her, and you could spend the rest of the Fourth Era in prison. Huh. Okay. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take prisoners. So wait, well, uh, oh, that's optional. <laughs> I guess if we go that way, it's all good. eyes are on you, lass. Don't disappoint us. Oh, interesting. Okay, so I guess I go this way and talk to that person. Before we begin, I want to make two things perfectly clear. One, I'm the best infiltrator this rat hole of a guild's got. So if you think you're here to replace me, you're dead wrong. And two, you follow my lead and do exactly as Hello. I say. No questions, no excuses. Then we understand each other. Good. Now, it's time to get your feet wet. And I don't want to waste a lot of time talking about anything but business. I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. Beer. We're in a bad way down here. Who knows? Old Delvin thinks it's some kind of curse. I think he's crazy. If you want my opinion, I'd say it's just plain old bad luck. You can get out there and start making a name for us again. Make them start fearing us like they did long ago. And while you're at it, make a little bit of coin on the side. Not a bad deal, eh? Uh... <laughs> yeah, I did. That wood elf's wit. He's a lot smarter than I expected. Can you believe that Fetcher mm. had more than tripled the guard? There must have been eight of them in there. It was like he was daring us to come and get him. Well, 
There's an old sewer tunnel that dumps into the lake on the northwest side of the island. That's how I slipped in there. Should still be unguarded. Okay. Mm. All right. But if you get arrested, don't blame it on me. Let's see. So I can. Oh wow. Okay. Oh, I can't train anymore. Okay. You think you're finished? You got plenty more where that came from. Shut up. All eyes are on you, lass. Don't disappoint us. Where's that person who's supposed to get me I my armor? You've got the backbone. Oh, probably you. All eyes are on you, lass. So you're the new Don't recruit, huh? Us. Well, looks like you and I are gonna have to get very well acquainted. I'm the fence down here. You come by anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for it. Ooh. Minus a little slice for the guild, of course. I can also provide a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. For a small fee. Hmm. Sure. How about I get Dirge to knock you over your head and dump you into the cistern? Look, I've been in this business a long time, and I've seen all types. You can play it tough, or you can play it smart. Whatever. At the end of the day, you'll find that all we care about down here is how much gold you can make us. Jeez. Good. Then there isn't much more to say. Here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. Probably not gonna use it. Well, you could always speak to Delvin or Vex if you're looking for extra work. Or if you're looking for training, we've got plenty of it down here. Delvin, Vex, Nerowin, and Vipper can give you a leg up on that. Uh -huh. All right then. All eyes are on you. Welcome last. to the cozy little. Don't disappoint. Oh, us. a bit of this and a bit of that. Let's see if I have anything. Oh, well, let's see what you have actually. Weapons. Hmm. Kind of have junk weapons. Potion. Yes. Uh, anything I can sell to you? Nah, not really. Oh, I can sell you this, though. Uh, I think... You know what? I don't really need this. Uh, you can have... Actually, I want to keep those for now. You can have that. Ooh. Carrying capacity. Yeah, I think I might put those on then. Uh, I don't really need that. Uh, I'll my magic card. Eh. I'll be fine. Don't really want that. I'll probably use it for something at some point. Can have these. Uh, I think I already use. Yeah, I already have that. Learn. You can have these. Uh, Ruby. She can have that too. And these ingredients. Honestly, I don't know why I use those for, other than potions. Uh, other than the carrying capacity, okay. Actually, yeah. I might actually wear these. Although that is really good. Uh, I think that's all for now.
Now, if you'll excuse me. So, let's see. So, two hand attacks do 15% more damage. Uh, I do kind of want this. Extra carry weight. Uh, I don't really care about pickpocketing. I really do that. But that might be worth it. Uh, that would take off my... These. Um... And you know what, let's do, just use those. Oh wait, that's not where I wanted to go. Wrong door. Angle over it. Wait. This way. Okay, now we can go this way. Ooh. How, uh, what? That's interesting. Cool. Uh, hello. How can a humble servant of Talos help you today? Nope. I'm good. What is it? Do, 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 do. Ooh. Anyway. Visiting Riften? All are welcome at the Temple of Mara. I guess let's head to this estate. I have no idea how far away it is. Uh, map. Oh, it's not that far away. Oh, it's right over there. Wow. Guessing that's the sewer. <laughs> Stupid skeevers. I don't know where the other one went, but... Did he send it all the way over here? Oh, 
cheese. No. What are you doing? Cheese. So that was a trap. Oh, geez, already? Guide to Better Thieving. So, level up. Uh, we're gonna increase stamina. Uh, I think... I kinda wanna start doing some uh, one-handed stuff. Something set off the, this. Something or someone. Wait. Did it just come out the same spot? Dang it. Really? Man, these lock picks are like super fragile. Oh, come on. to steal all your bread and cheese. Let's go back out.
There we go. Ooh. Taking all your cheese and food. I'll take that. Battle axe. Lydia. I assume that's the front door. Ooh. Uh. Sure. Seriously. Dang it. I'm waiting to open up one of these, and there's just like a guard inside. I'll take that. I hear someone walking. Someone there? Now. Hey, watch what you're doing. Over here. Sure. My money is on the big one. They're just fighting Liddy. Yeah. You're a disgrace. Your own kind. Time to end this. Those fools are actually fighting.
worthless mercenaries. I didn't think Hello. Haven or Mercer would allow me to get away with this, but I had little choice. Boop. Boop. See you. Find you. Where are you? I'll see you. You can't hide from me. Shot that. Dang it. Die. Oh well, must have run off. See you. I think this is... Time 
How the heck do I get out of here? That could have gone a lot better. Okay, we'll just stick here for a bit. Actually, let's just wait like four hours. Hopefully now they are no longer on high alert. Come on. Now, just wait like two hours. Hmm. Could I lure them away? Problem is still getting up there though. Come on. I believe I have
Nope. That a dragon? Great. Uh... Potions. I think he's using frost. fun. Let's uh, mark this location quick. Snowshod Farm. I'm guessing that stone is up top here. You know, I'll take a steel dagger. Once a day, I'll come, come invisible. Mm -hmm. uh, that might be useful. Mm 
There's also a cave over here by the looks. Nightingale Hall. Okay. Whatever you say. Guard might get nervous. A woman approaches with her weapon drawn. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Uh, where is the entrance? Was I think by the front into the side. Right around this corner. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something. In the old fort, they're rifting. I could see the joint up myself. Right. The Imperators think us all lawless beasts. I'm proof of their ignorance. Wait, where is that? Oh, wait, that's Black Pick. Never mind. Everything's all right. Ah, that's right, it's over here. Dragon flagon. Come here a second. Word on the street is Golden Glow's been hit. Good job, lass. Let me take a look at what you found. Arengar sold Golden Glow? What's that idiot thinking? He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? Nope. Blast. Well, I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackbriar. She asked for you by name. I uh, okay. Uh, no, nothing like that. You're calling on her for business. That's between you and Maven, and I'd prefer to keep it that way. Don't worry about it. Maven's business dealings usually involve quite a bit of gold for her people. <laughs> of course, your pay. <laughs> You're smart as a whip, lass. Keep doing right by us, and there's plenty more where that came from. Ooh, nice. Don't you have better things to do than disturb me? Okay, well... We're going to uh, leave it off there for today. I hope y'all enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.